Welcome to Phillips Highway. We're here in Jacksonville, Florida, and I wanted to show you one of my favorite plants. Phillips Highway is the most botanically awesome place in the world, and I apologize for the sound quality if you can't hear me very well. I'll try to speak up. Anyways, I wanted to show you one of my favorite plants. This is called a rubber tree. The Latin name is called Ficus Elastica. And I recently gotten some online spat with some people about using this plant in a landscape. They said it you know, was a South Florida plant, would not do good up here in a cold frost. But if you look at this one, this one's doing great. We have this building to the right of us, which keeps this plant nice and warm during the winter time. When you get a hard frost, uh, you know, the heat that comes and radiates off of a building can make a big difference for tropical plants. Also having a canopy, we have a nice palm tree above us that, you know, kind of captures some of that frost as well. If we did get a really cold uh, frost, this plant could die back down to the ground, but the roots will stay alive and then what happens is a bunch of shoots pop up out of it. So I think it looks really cool when all the shoots come out of it. I love this big, dense, tropical uh, plant, and I love to use it in landscapes. So I just wanted to share with you guys, let you know what's possible up here in Northeast Florida. I don't want you to, you know, hold yourself back from using really cool tropical plants in your yard. So if you need help with your yard, finding, you know, what spots in your landscape you can experiment with trying different kinds of cold-hardy tropicals, let me know. I'd be happy to help.